So I am here for the opening night of the San Matias Beach Hotel over here in Palma Nova for summer 2024 and I'm very lucky to be staying in one of their junior suites too but we're going to go and check out what dinner and what the after dinner entertainment is like in this video too but stay tuned too because we're going to see what it's like waking up over here at the San Matias Beach Hotel and just check out the views as well. Night has recently fallen so the lights are just going on in the resorts here and we can see right over towards Magaluf as well. Now in the summer months you can see a lot more open over here but for the time being let's head on down towards the dining room. Okay, so you can see we've got some lovely starters and I love the look of these poke bowls here. We've got some gazpacho as well. We've got a wide variety of food this evening and I suspect that we've got the chef here waiting to grill some meat, which looks absolutely delicious. Now just coming along the bar counter here too, we've got some vegetables, potatoes, we've got meatballs, We've got, even got a chicken curry, chicken tikka masala and some grilled fish. Looks like dorada or lubina which is uh, sea bass. Got the country pie, fantastic choice of bread, cheese and biscuits and then a wonderful salad bar too. Okay so this all looks fabulous, I can see a paella has just been put out so I'm going to go and grab myself a portion. So dinner service here is at 6.30 every single day and they close the restaurant at 8.30 but there's a great buffet and this evening, I think you saw I just picked out a little bit of paella and also some breadcrumb fish as well. I've also got like a little poke bowl of salad too so it's quite healthy. But the food here looks really good and I've got some show cooking as well taking place. There's really something for everyone here so even for fussy eaters coming over you're going to find something that you really like. And they change the menu every single day and don't forget it's going to be up on the screens on the TV in the lounge as well and also you can get access to that menu on your TV in your room too. Anyway I'm going to start eating so cheers. And now for the dessert as well and they've got loads of really nice dessert. Look we've got some apple pie I'm definitely going to have some of that. And check this out, look, we've got a mixed fruit cake. This looks absolutely delicious. Got a selection of yogurts. And just coming over here as well to the postres. Check these out, they look absolutely delicious. Got some cheesecake as well, and also some pudding as well. This is very popular in Mallorca too. They call it creme catalane or creme brulee. So this is my dessert. Okay, so um, after a few portions of paella, I think I had to have just a bit of everything for dessert, which is a great thing about being on holiday because, well, you can do that, can't you? <laughs> Okay, so we've just had dinner. We've come into the entertainment area, which you will have seen in my first video. And we're waiting for some evening entertainment, but we're going to see what they've got. I think they've got some singers coming on this evening, so let's see what they're like. Okay, so I just have to show you here which drinks they've got at the bar over here at the Hotel San Matias Beach. You're going to be delighted to see that they've got John Smith's. It's not widely available in the bars over here in Mallorca, but look, they've got it on tap. We've got Heineken, we've got Strongbow, Amstrel. Of course you've got some sangria on the side too, as well as some bottles, beers as well, as well as your all-important San Miguel. But they've also got some ciders as well, plus you've got all your, your top shelf spirits too. Okay, so I think the show is about to start this evening and the screen has gone up.
so the entertainment here was absolutely excellent tonight. Anyway, I'm going to go and crash out now. I hope you enjoyed the show, but let's head on back upstairs. Well, that was a fantastic evening. I really enjoyed that. And um, as I said before, the acts change every single night. And if you're here for two weeks, we're not going to see the same act twice. But there's a really good atmosphere down, down there. Now, it's not really busy at the moment because, of course, it's the very first night of the 2024 season. Of course, it's going to get a lot busier over here as the season does go on. So expect this hotel to be absolutely packed during the summer. But I have to say as well, I just want to make this point. Um, I'm not being paid to stay here and my opinion here is that my opinion this isn't ad this isn't an advert for the hotel but I have to say the hotel is super clean it's super nice but best of all the staff are really friendly everyone here is genuinely friendly as well and for me I think it's the reason why so many people come back here year after year and I, I totally get it I totally understand it anyway stick with me because coming up in this video we're going to go and see what breakfast is like but for now I'm going to get um, a few hours sleep I'm absolutely shattered it's been a busy day but um, we're gonna see what the mornings are like here over at the Hotel San Matias Beach anyway for now I'm just gonna say good night And good morning, Palma Nova. What a morning to wake up to this morning. Just check out the views from over here at the San Matias Beach Hotel. I'm so lucky to be here. I can't believe it. I'm whispering because I don't want to wake up any of my, uh, my neighbors. Okay, so I've got ready. Let's head on that downstairs. Let's go and see what breakfast is like this morning. So I'm the first one down this morning. Let's go and check out what's on the breakfast menu this morning. So even check out the view that you can get from the tables here for breakfast if you're down here early enough. Of course, it depends on the time of year, but this will be my view this morning. Let's go and see what they've got for breakfast today. So we've got a great choice of juices here. See some nice fresh orange juice as well. And this is what I absolutely love, a fantastic selection of fruit too. Got some fresh pineapple some melon and also some yogurt too and a choice of fresh fruit. Now here comes the fun stuff. Check this out. Look we've got all the donuts. Got some cake. And of course some little mini enzymadas, little Mallorquin pastries here. Of course here breakfast is self-service. You can literally have as much or as little as you want. And if you're going for the healthier option, which I don't think I will be today, I normally am quite healthy, but look, you've got a great selection of cereals here too. And dried fruits. Or you can just get your European continental breakfast. Got plenty of ham on serrano and cheese. This is very popular actually. This is a very popular breakfast over here in Spain. Eating sausages and cheese for breakfast. Okay, so as much as I love an English breakfast, it's a bit too early in the morning for me. It's also a little bit too early in the morning as well for the pastries. I might come back for one of those later. So I think I'm going to just go and grab some toast. So what a fantastic start today here at the San Matias Beach Hotel. The views from the restaurant are just incredible. So um, I've got my coffee, I've got my toast, I've got my fruit. I'm gonna tuck in now and enjoy. Mm -hmm. 
Okay, so it's looking like it's going to be an absolutely gorgeous day over in Parmanova. So I'm going to make the most of my last few hours in the hotel. Now, don't forget as well, and I'm going to show you here that there is a questionnaire right next to the bed which you must fill out as well if you're staying over here because it will pop you into a draw for a free stay for the following season as well. So I might just do it myself because I actually wouldn't mind coming back here. The hotel's absolutely amazing. Also as well, if you are booking, don't forget that they've got special loyalty programs as well for frequent visitors. You can see their Facebook page as well and you can see what's going on over there. But in the meantime, consider subscribing if you haven't done so already. You can also find me on the Facebook page, a Facebook group and on my Instagram also called Mallorca Under the Sun. Okay everyone, thanks very much for watching and I shall see you on the next video.